Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix Dying Light the Beast game crashing, not launching or lagging or showing black screen or other issues on PS5. So let's go through it. To restart your PlayStation, so this is one of the best way to fix the issue. It will resolve the temporary bugs or glitches that is leading to such problem. You just need to open PS5 screen and click on PlayStation button on controller. Then select power button and finally select restart PS5. After restarting PS5, check if the issue is fixed. If not, next method is to rebuild database. For that switch off your PS5, hold down power button unless two beep sound occur. Now leave the power button to enter safe mode. Here connect DualSense controller via USB cable and select rebuild database. After this, check if the issue is fixed. If not, next is to check storage space on console. For that go to PS5 settings and move down to storage. Here you will see console storage and extended storage. Now check each of them by clicking on, on it and then delete save data. Once done, now check if the problem is resolved or not. If not, next solution is to switch Wi-Fi frequency. For that first go to settings on PS5 then click on network then settings then set up network connection. Here click on options. Now under Wi-Fi frequency you can switch to 5 GHz or 2.4 GHz and then check if the problem is resolved. If not, next solution is to change language or console. First open PS5 settings then go to system, here select language options in the left sidebar, then select current language, after that change the language to English or any other and then check if the issue is resolved or not. Next method is to check for game update. You should ensure the game is updated and not running on outdated version. For that first highlight the game, now press options button, now choose check for update. If any update is available, click on update and then follow the instructions to proceed further. Next solution is to restore licenses. For that, open settings. On PS5, now click on user and account, then move down to others on left panel. Now select restore licenses. After that, select Dying Light the Beast game and then click on restore and finally confirm by selecting yes. Once done, check if the problem is fixed. Next is to check PS5 overheating. Make sure your PS5 is not overheating and is well ventilated. If it's overheating, try to cool down for some time before using it. This will help to fix the issue on PS5. Next method is to sign out and sign in to PS5. First go to settings, then tap on users and accounts. Next go down and click on other option. After that click on sign out option. Once done, again log into the PS5 account and check for the error if it is resolved. Next solution is to install software updates on PS5. For that open settings on your PS5. Then select system. Now go to system software. Then system software update and settings. After that select update system software if any update is available and finally select update using internet option. Once the software update is installed on PS5, now check if the problem is fixed. If not, next is to delete games save file PS5. For that open settings on your PS5 menu. Now select save data PS5 here. Select upload or delete from console storage and finally select dying light the beast game. And after that check if the issue is fixed. Next solution is to reset your console settings. For that Launch settings on your PS5 then move to system. After that select reset options under system software. Here select reset default settings. At last select restore option. Now check if it is fixed. If not next is to reinstall Dying Light the Beast game. So for that first highlight Dying Light the Beast on your PS5 and then press options on your controller. Now select del delete and confirm it. Finally restart your PS5 and install Dying Light the Beast game again to check for the error if it is fixed or not. If not, the final solution is to contact support. So when nothing works, then you should take help from the PlayStation support. The link I have provided in the description. Just go through it and explain the issue you are coming across. And hopefully the team will help you to fix the issue you are coming across. So that's all for now in this video. Thank you.